then preterm babies at the neonatal intensive unit of the Tamale Teaching Hospital are paired in incubators. Senior pediatrician at the unit, Abdul Mumin, said newborn babies risk contracting cross infection. A report by Stanley Niblo. The Tamale Teaching Hospital remains the premier health facility in the northern part of the country. As a major referral center, the hospital annually admits more than 50,000 patients. The neonatal intensive care unit plays an essential role in the survival of newborn babies through the use of infant incubators. Last year, the unit admitted a total of 2,300 babies, with 30% being preterm babies. 20% of babies admitted at the facility also weigh below 2.5 kilograms. As at the first quarter of this year, the neonatal intensive care unit has 850 admissions, with 250 being preterm babies. However, neonates are paired in incubators that are meant for one because they are not enough. This according to the senior pediatrician at the neonatal intensive care unit. Abdul Mumin impacts negatively on the health of neonates. For the babies that we pair, the risk of infection is higher. So if we get more incubators just for the time of stabilization, we get to keep every baby in their own incubator. That reduces the risk of cross-infection. Kokroko Charity Foundation has meanwhile presented two Draga branded infant incubators to the unit after a first one in 2016. The neonatal intensive care unit of the Tamale Teaching Hospital has received two incubators. This has brought the total number of incubators to 13, but authorities say they will need 20 more so they would be able to cater for the number of preterm babies that come to the facility to receive further care. 2016 Ghana Journalist of the Year, Kwame Sifakain, who is also the founder of Kokroko Charity Foundation, says the foundation is determined to save lives of newborn babies. We are doing our best to give as many as we can, and um, we're hoping that we'll put smiles on the faces of mothers, give hope to mothers, give a life to a child, and uh, just impact our health delivery system in Ghana. The incubators are among 10 donated to health facilities in the Northern Belt. Kwame Sifaka indicated the gesture is not politically motivated. The Tamale Teaching Hospital also requires resources to address other concerns. <laughs> Roof of the corridor of the obstetric department close to the administration block is bat infested. A source at the hospital said recent fumigation has not solved the issues. Racks have been used to improvise but that has not also helped much. Stanley Nibliu, TV3 News, Tamale, Northern Region.